What's going on, motherfuckers? Guess what? It's time for a St. Ives Crew video. Right now, the eye's pretty fucking straight. It's gonna get crooked as we go along, folks. This here St. Ives is absolutely fucking refreshing and delicious. Has a July date on it. Where's that? July 27th of 20. I don't know where the fuck it is, but there it is. So, pretty decently fresh as fuck. Cold as fuck. Had it in the fridge a good 24 fucking hours. And then in the fucking freezer for a good two to four fucking minutes. So this thing's nice and fucking ready to be drank, folks. <laughs> Mexican fucking heavy metal folks. That's what I fucking wanted to play in this authentic St. Ives Crew high gravity malt liquor, 40 ounce, 8.2 alcohol percent by volume, red label fucking video. Coming out of Wisconsin, huh? God damn. I'm gonna have to write these motherfuckers. P.O. Box 739, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, 53201. Hey, guys over at fucking St. Ives, I need a lot more of this in my area, you fucking pieces of shit. Oh, God. Shout out to the spot where I got these from in the first place. That malt liquor store in heaven of over there in New Jersey. But my first box came in March 10th. So I've been holding on to it for a while. Not freebasing it. Not fucking freebasing it. Good God. Save the malt liquor. Save the fucking malt liquor, folks. Run the campaign. Malt liquor does matter. So, since I'm down to my last one, it's coming close to the expiration date. It's time to make a fucking malt liquor video. And I ordered up some more. They were supposed to be delivered today. I'm not upset. This one's here. But it fucking, it promised. La duda inmunda de seguir o renunciar En nosotros no tiene cabida, nunca la tendrá Resistir, resistir ante los problemas Shout out to everybody in the fucking St. Ives crew. And you know who is not in the St. Ives crew? Shady fucking Malt Shadows. Shady, go fuck yourself, asshole. You're never going to be in the crew. You are not crew material. You fucking suck, Shady. <laughs> uh, drinking 42 ounce Plaz Dicks. Fuck, if they made a fucking 42 ounce St. Ives, maybe he'd be able to get that, but... Not delicious glass. Nope. <sighs> Shout out to the originator of the St. Ives crew. Lou Bag Larry. Uh, Shout out to everybody in the motherfucker. The only one that I know for sure is Nick Hill. <laughs> Shout out to Nick Hill. Drinking St. Ives. Son of a bitch. I know there's others. But I just fucking don't really know who they are. Fear. And uh, a couple others. But... We'll get it all sorted out, folks. We'll get the roster fucking figured out here. But it's good shit. I know Havana has been drinking St. Ives. Shout out to Havana. Man, I know he's been freebasing the fuck out of malt liquor. He's been on a bender, folks. <laughs> good God. <laughs> It's time for some of these Pocky Ghost Pepper Chips. Here's the Richter Scale Heat. 
And they're all the way at the fucking end. Hot stuff. Uh. Best part about these chips, they're not all fucking broken up. Pretty big. Pretty good. Best part about this fucking 40 is this goddamn delicious as fuck. Man, I'm gonna get fucking trashed drinking it. Good God. That's easy. Everybody knows that. Shout out to Mr. Met for making a fucking 55 minute long malt liquor fucking video over the weekend or whenever the fuck he made that goddamn thing. I don't fucking. I'm gonna find the time. I'll probably watch it after this. Who the fuck knows? I'm gonna be getting a buzz going. I'll be watching and catching up on everything. I know Pistol Glenn was out there smacking the fucking bongos, looking like a fucking fool with his pants on the ground over there in goddamn 32 ounce fucking Florida. Pistol Glenn, I haven't even seen you drink a 32 ounce in a while. I know your doctor recommended against it, but sometimes you gotta bend the fucking rules and quit drinking those fucking 24, excuse me, 16 ounce. I'm looking at fucking 16 ounce cans right there sitting on my goddamn shelf. Empty, but basically go fuck yourself, ass so. You know who else needs to go fuck theyself? Reed Gabe. Reed Gabe, if you're watching this, some fucking how. <laughs> Where you at, dude? Who the fuck told you to quit making videos? Did you change your fucking name or something? Where the fuck are you, you asshole? <sighs> Black flag, forty ounce. Put out a fucking video today. I didn't get a chance to watch it. I just got home, folks. And I was going to make an outdoor video, but my fucking phone, I need to charge it. Long story fucking short. I was like, fuck it. I'm ready to get drunk now. So, 30-something percent on the phone. Playing fucking music just fine. I know the fucking St. Ives crew list is extensively long. It's got a lot of fucking names on it. Shout out to Still Worldwide as well. I've seen that motherfucker have a St. Ives once. And he's been making fucking videos. I've been trying to keep up. Let's see what he has to say about the new uh, knee to neck ratio and how fucked up that was. Good God. And I don't know. I've seen Fears been making his fucking videos. And I got to see if there ain't some way, shape, or form I could send him something from California to add to his collection of stuff and get his way up to 40 fucking 40s. Uh. All right, folks, time to swill this motherfucker out. Under 10, I'm sorry. It should have been around 5, but we're getting fucking crooked. It's always a good time when you're getting fucking crooked. <laughs> Nosotros no tienen la vida, no, nunca la tendremos. 